Good morning, this is Dwayne, and today we're going to look at how to play the same song a dozen or so different ways. Uh, a lot of people don't know that, that you, you have free will. You can choose to play a song lots and lots of ways. Of course, you have to have uh, knowledge of chords and arranging and so on to do that, but I'm just going to walk you through a simple song. I think I'll take Kumbaya, and we'll just play it through a do at least a do dozen different ways, okay, just to show you what's possible. So, uh, the simplest way would be just to play the melody with maybe a chord in the left hand. And by the way, simple songs like that, they usually just have two or three chords. This has three chords. It has the C chord, which is C, E, G, the F chord, F, uh, C, F, A, I'm playing it upside down, of course, and the G seventh chord, which is B, F, and G. I'm leaving D out just for because it's a little muddier that way, but you can play the D if you want to. Okay, just three chords, which are the primary chords in the key of C. One, four, and five, seven. And of course, if you played it in D flat, it'd be one, four, and five, seven. If you played it in D, it'd be one, four, and five, seven. If you played it in E flat, it'd be one, four, five, seven, and so on, okay? You understand that, I'm sure. So I'm just gonna pick out the melody and hold the chords in the left hand. So that'll be way number one. holding the chord in the left hand, or we could play the left hand in quarter notes. Okay, so that's way number two. Now we could play it uh, in Alberti bass, couldn't we? Alberti bass is where you take the bottom note of a chord, the top note, and then the middle note, like this. Bottom, top, middle, top, bottom, top, middle, top, bottom, top, middle, top, bottom, top. Okay, that's that's. Uh, uh, quarter notes. One, two, three, four. but we could speed it up. We could play an eighth notes. Okay, that's way number what? Four, I guess. <laughs> we could also play it in. Uh, I'll call it a continuity bass by hitting a low a low C and then three C chords and then a low F and then F chords, okay? could play it uh, in a swing bass, and that means uh, we could play the root chord, fifth chord, root chord, fifth chord, the root of a chord, and then the fifth of a chord on the third beat, okay, again. We don't have to play those chords in root position. We can use upward inversions, for example. Watch this. I'm playing the C chord, but I'm turning upside down each time. Same way for the F chord. Same way for G7 chord. Uh, or we could use an open voiced, I don't know what, I've lost track. That's probably number eight or something like that. Or we could use an open voice uh, arpeggio. Uh, we're breaking the chord up into three parts. Root, fifth, and then third. Watch. Root, fifth. Let's 
couldn't we? limited just playing the melody by itself on the right hand. We could play chords in the right hand, couldn't we? And that could be combined with any of those left hand styles. Sounding a lot fuller already, isn't it? Or we could use swing bass with that. Let me move it up and up, up and up. Also could break up the notes of the chord in the right hand. Listen. And so on like that. Or we could play it in block chords. Watch this. Block chords, or you can play them big block chords. Or you can play it in garner style. You can play it in a flowing river of sound. That means arpeggio in the left hand and uh, broken chords in the right hand, like this. sloppy but you can, it was also about what 12 or 13 uh, different ways to play the same uh, song and that was my point so there's lots and lots of ways so the more you learn about music the more you learn about chords the more you learn about form the learner, more you learn about styles and so on uh, the better because it'll just enhance your piano playing and what I did to a simple song like that Kumbaya you could do it to any song not classical songs of course but any kind of pop or gospel or whatever so okay so that's it for today and we'll see you again tomorrow with another video so bye bye for now